Hi friends, today is just a really quick video I wanted to share with you with this really valuable website, our data sets. So it's sitting here on GitHub and what it is, is a list of, as of the time of me recording this, 1,892 data sets. So that is all of the base R and then a whole lot of the R package data sets. And so the really useful thing, if we click on available data sets, is that we can see an entire list of them. It tells us what package, tells us the name of the data set, has the title. Uh, we can link up to some information there. But what's also really handy is it tells me how many of each type of variable there are. So if I am wanting to do a particular teaching example, and I need to ensure that I have some factors, or numeric, or binary, or I want a particularly uh, large data set, so it's got number of rows and number of columns, then I can do a hunt to find data that is going to suit what I want to do an example of. In addition, uh, we have a search box. So we can search these titles as well. And if you have been using R and some, seen some of the data sets that are in there, you'll know that some are nice and clearly titled, and the ones we see here are all pretty clearly titled. Some not so much, so we won't necessarily always get a great search, but we can just type in. So suppose I am interested in climate data. Then here we go. Different, uh, some of the different packages that have data. It's got... Uh, Australian Historical Annual Climate Data is going to be pretty handy. We've got another one, Temperature Summary. I think that one we would need to dive a little bit more into. Uh, but we can just type in particular areas that we are interested in, see whether something comes up. Alternatively, if we're just looking for some interesting data, maybe do some sort of project, we can also just have a bit of a scroll. And we can see all sorts of things uh, in here, and uh, one that I'm going to be using for a forthcoming video, uh, the resume, and there's a couple of different resume related ones, uh, really interesting, sports cards, student teacher achievement ratios, all sorts of different stuff, uh, because it's covering so many different packages. So that is all I wanted to share with you today, but I think it's a really helpful resource, it's one that I hadn't come across uh, in this form before, I had seen something similar but not as user-friendly, uh, but I think this is going to be really helpful if you are looking for built-in data sets to be able to work with for teaching or examples or practice or projects.